hanging on and hoping Owen's not going to let him go. And all Owen supporters now willing him to finish it. effort from Evans, he's still trying to swing punches to get out of this. left in this round for Owen to finish it if he can that he got for it but that was touch and go for Wayne Evans and in the end he was wriggling about this ring like a fly on a sticky paper so once again the Welshman from Hampshire Wayne Evans in the white shorts comes out to face the remorseless barrage from Johnny Owen marvellous fight a good champion and a brave and talented challenger. Not a flicker of expression across the face of Owen as he goes to work. courage from Evans he goes into a crouch and every time he comes up out of it there's leather in his face all the time nothing now but guts keeping Evans going the cause is virtually hopeless but he's still trying to Southpaw from Wayne Evans. We thought he might do that. I wonder if that right hand is bothering him. No matter where he goes, the fists of Owen follow him. Seems of delirious delight here from people. And meanwhile, Evans, poor Wayne Evans, simply doesn't know where he is, or what day it is, or what's hit him.
and he comes up and he claps the winner. Have you ever seen anything more sporting in your life than that? He got up off the floor and he clapped the winner. Isn't that marvellous? What a marvellous fight. Crying with disappointment, Evans. And John... And Johnny Owen, at last, lets some emotion come across that poker face. His first defence of the British bantamweight title, and a memorable one at that. Here is an extraordinary young man. Murphy's Johnny Owen now has two notches on the Lonsdale belt. He needs one more title win to make the belt his own property. Well, Ebervale have had a night to remember with a marvellous fight. A fine champion and a very, very brave challenger in Wayne Evans. Everything about the night was memorable. The best night in Welsh professional boxing for a long time. Two fine young men in the middle of the stage. Jack Peterson putting the belt around the waist of the champion. And the whole crowd in this leisure centre at Evervale standing and applauding and appreciating two very fine young men. So there it is, Johnny Owen of Merpa is still the British bantamweight champion and Wayne Evans of Wales and Waterlooville comes out of this as a very, very gallant challenger. And with these scenes of triumph behind, it's time to say goodnight to you.